Okay, so this video we're going to do trolling uh, dead garfish for pelagics, and we're going to use a uh, Suncoast Scoot Tough Terminal Tackle uh, 370 hook trolling rig, which has flash tied into it as well to help attract other pelagics. We have a nose cone to make for easy rigging and the pink speed skirt as well. So the important thing when you're rigging up a garfish for trolling for fish with teeth is we use wire so you make sure there's wire in there which all of our rigs do. So with a gar, this one's actually a fairly small gar. So what we'll do is we just sort of give them a bit of a bend. You don't want to break the skin otherwise the fish won't swim properly. Give them a rag, just rubberizing is what we call it. Give it a bit of a shake so you know that it's going to move. And so you get your 370 rig. We've got a wire post on the front, in front of the first hook. You want that to go up through, from the bottom of the fish's jaw up through the top of its mouth. So you then line the hooks up so that they sit loosely on there. You don't want them being tight because it then restricts the movement of your bait. So with this one, pretty far back but we'll get it in anyway move up to the next one make sure it's nice and loose you don't stretch it out so that it's the furthest apart that it can possibly be and the top hook with the chin weight on it and the pretty flash sitting under there that looks really good. And then line that up with there. Go through from underneath, through the top. Should look like that coming out the top. Put your cone down, you might need to break some of the beak off and turn your cheek. And use cutters. Go down, and there's a little tab on the cone. Match of the tab goes over the side, then you just screw it down on. And that way it pulls off that, not off the hooks themselves. Once that's on and pretty looking like that, you then slide your little pink octopus or squid skirt or whatever you want to call them. There are so many different names these days. Just like that. And so what I'm going to use is you drop it over the side and when she's in the water being trolled along slowly she'll swim like that. Might not be as accentuated as that, but it will swim good. And you want to troll them about four to six knots, troll, slow trolling, whether you're on a kayak, a jet ski, your boat, doesn't matter. Just have them a, a good 50 metres back behind the boat so they're sitting just outside the prop wash and in your wake and when you're trolling over bait schools and around Mermaid or Palmy off the coast where everyone else is anchored up fishing for spotties, you slow troll these around the outside and you'll catch the big Spanish that are feeding on the spotties and the bigger fish there and they're a lot more fun than the little spotties, I can tell you that now. So that's just a quick little video on how to rig those go up. Whoop.